guys, it's Mina. Welcome back to another beautiful day in the garden. We just did a really cool pour for our great switcheroo collaboration with Canella and Tammy Anderson and Sarah Mack and Erica Hughes and myself and I have some paint left over so we're gonna pour again. This is a canvas actually that I had used when my secret Santa sent me a colander for our <laughs> very Merry Christmas collab, which was a lot of fun. I will link that one up for you, here for you. But so we're gonna reuse this canvas because I'm not really crazy about how it turned out and I have paint left, so let's have some fun. I'm also gonna be using Mixed Media Girls Split Cup, the two chamber one. This is an awesome fun. I've had a lot of fun with this so far. So let's go ahead and layer this first. My colors real quick, cadmium red from Liquitex Basics, cadmium orange from Liquitex Basics, cadmium yellow from Liquitex Basics, uh, Decoard Americana Decor Satin Enamels in pure white with some Amsterdam Titanium White, 24 karat gold and, from Decoart, and then this is uh, Amsterdam Bronze. So, let's layer this. I'm gonna start with, so that gold is a lot thinner. This one's a lot thicker. So we're gonna put just a little bit of gold in the bottom. Very small amount on this side. And then I'm gonna come in with the red thicker layer and then just a well, actually I'm gonna put the bronze in first because I wasn't really crazy about the orange in the last one so we'll mix it up a bit put the yellow next to that a little bit more gold and some white and then let's do it again but I'm gonna put some bronze in there first because I don't want to put the red next to the white. And back to the red and some more bronze. Oh, gonna have a lot of bronze in this one. <laughs> some orange. Some yellow. And it's about to overflow. So I'm going to stop on that side and let's do the other side. So this one, I'm going to start with a little bit of gold in the bottom, and then I'm going to put some white in there, and then yellow, and some bronze, and some orange, and a nice shot of red. Go backwards this time. We'll put some orange in, the bronze, and the yellow, a little bit of white, and another shot of bronze. And now we're getting to the top, and some more red. So I'm going to put red both on both sides. Right, this is gonna be cool. All right, so now I'm gonna take the thinned out gold. And we're gonna pour a puddle of this in the center and then I'm gonna pour into that. Stretch that out just a little bit. Now it looks like a flower. <laughs> Are you ready, husband of awesomeness? I'm my last name. Do a, let's do a ring pour. Pretty cool, I love what's happening in there. Just gonna fix that center, just a touch. Just let me swirl. Okay, that's very cool. I'm gonna take that, which one is the thin one? This one. We're gonna go around this with our thin gold. Okay, we're just gonna 
going to roll this around a bit to cover up some of that gold. Up does really beautiful things so you can get those on um, mixed media girl on her Etsy shop I believe and because this is a repour we do want to make sure that we get our sides covered as well so I am going to do that too because we don't want blue sides on a paint red and gold and I'm just going to take some gold on my fingers and put it on the sides. And this is the thicker gold, and that's okay with me. I mean, we're probably gonna go over the edge anyhow, but I just wanna have something on there covering up that blue. We gotta torch it still too. I love the cells that are coming up. That part is so pretty. I like the center, I like that part. Very cool. around a little bit and see where it wants to go. like a flow extender. <laughs> Other things rolling over itself a little bit down there. I'm okay with this being thin on here because it is a repour. I don't want to leave a lot of paint on the canvas. I'd rather stretch out what we've got. Thank you. 
so funny. The paint smells funny today. It smells like Play-Doh. Maybe it's just because I haven't used Liquitex in a while. Well, that's turning out kind of neat. That's looking pretty cool. I can fix the edges off camera. I don't have to waste your time with that. Let's dry my hands off and we'll give this a quick torch. I think we're going to be done. What do you think, HOA? Awesome. I like it. Oh my, I decorated myself profusely, didn't I? these little cells that are popping up the gold cells coming up and that was again that gold flow extender that we put around it and we let it roll over it I think that's where these gold cells are coming up from I kind of want to try to open this up a little bit more to see if it moves oh if it's not then that's okay too let's move in a little bit stop there <laughs> this was awesome I love this this is my favorite thing actually is when I have leftover paint and an old canvas and I'm like let's just see what happens and sometimes you get something really awesome so this was cool thank you guys so much for being with us today I will show you this one when it's dry okay so here we are several days later <laughs> this one is totally dry now this came out really really cool I really love that color combination of the cadmium red deep and the orange and the yellow with the gold and the white satin enamels. Just some really, really beautiful stuff. Some nice depth in there. Some beautiful details. Lots of those cool little gold pearly cells. And the pearly cells come from putting the gold down as our base coat. Our flow extender, remember how we tilted it to cover that gold a little bit. Really pretty lines in here. I love those little cells. This part is really, really cool too. I love these where you see where the lines stretched out and spread a little bit. Really beautiful depth. Nice and soft. The gold's not overpowering, especially where, like, that part is really pretty where it mixed with the orange and the yellow and the gold. Really cool. Very neat stuff, especially up here, especially with the satin enamels in there. I like those lines a lot. I love this part too. The center is pretty cool. So this one was a lot of fun. This was our leftover paint with a split cup from our leftover from our great switcheroo collaboration. <laughs> Canella and Tammy and Erica and Sarah and myself. It was a lot of fun. I'll link that video for you down below so you guys can watch it if you haven't seen it. But this was awesome. So I really like the split cup that Marcy made, the Mixed Media Girl ones. Those are awesome. You can find them on her Etsy shop. And uh, this was cool. So this one's a 24 by 24. And I think this is going to be our sunshine split cup. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with us. I'll see you for the next one. Have a wonderful day.